Uh, good morning, friends. Well, I'll just do a little painting for you. It's, uh, in the style of Edward Wesson. Um, it's the old uh, Edward Wesson. They, they, uh, the old uh, huts at Wattbeck, well, round about there. Uh, the all the huts, they are. Um, The, usually the ferryman uses the ferry across the river about here, just up here. Just a couple of huts, uh, you can see here. Just a note to see if other ferrymen who want to go across the old tree there and the, the path winding down the background with the boat yards in the back and the uh, the yachts and things you know just over there. Well that's all there is to it really, so it's a very simple one really. So we'll just have a go at this one, eh? shall we? Yeah, okay. Find a, a decent pair of glasses. There's glasses hanging around everywhere here. I tend to buy glasses. Because I've misplaced them all over the place. So it's a... Uh, I'll we'll show a brush out first of all and bring our things nearer to us for water. We'll start off with a, a blue sky. Uh, ultramarine's fine. Oh, and you could put a little bit of cerulean in it if you want. Just take a little and then be very quick. Um, put a few, uh, make up shapes of a few clouds. Now you can have them, we'll have. We can have one coming towards us, say, coming down from up there, down towards us, these clouds. There we are. Uh, we'll have a, uh, usually it works out as a, the three to one ratio. What I mean is if you've got, to, you know, with your clouds and that. Ah. Uh, we're running okay, I think. Yeah. Oh, that's a bit wet, really. Dry, when you get too wet, dry your brush off and take out some of the... Oh, it'll run. And there we are. A little bit of uh, cobalt, nice in this, coming towards the horizon here. Uh, there's a few pencil lines there you can see, but they rub off, okay. There we are. Oh, okay, it's, uh, we'll, we'll bring it right down into, into the water area here. And then we'll bring this here. It's very light that, but it's, that's all it needs to be. It's only a, a sketch we're doing. There we are. We won't try and overdo it. Um, dry out your brush and take out any runners like this end piece here where it's running down to there. Then you may grab over some umber. This umber's Winsor & Newton. It's, uh, as a warm cast of it, and you, you're bringing it down here, and this is the, um, you can use it for the, the sand here, but of course it's, I won't let that wet you, it's dry, just do that. Okay, so your path coming down here and runs into the, that total area there of sand, but of course you'll have some greenery on there and there, as you go on, you see, so you 
that's what we'll do. I hope I'm talking loud enough here. Now, I've just picked up a size 8 brush and I'll just uh, pick up some uh, ultramarine and pop a little uh, red into this. Uh, And we, we can just bring a, a skyline across here. It wouldn't be so purple, of course, but still. But there. Oh, that's lucky enough, I've got it clean. It's okay. So we'll have a bit of a skyline. And you can put your. your few warehouses in there. Are your derricks or your ships there and just leave it like that that's all you're doing okay dry it out a bit just go across it and take any runs off it like that and then we bring in the, uh, bring in some cobalt it's an easy color to mix with a green with so if you've got your cobalt and you're going to mix it with a little bit of yellow cad yellow you can't go wrong with a bit of cad yellow and you, a bit of cobalt and you'll have a, a nice green you can't go wrong with it so this part here we'll just have the greens coming under the under the under the, the both the uh, on the little bits and parts up and down here along the path eh? then blending it out now you can have a, a, more over this side here uh, just uh, coming down the, this way grassy area and we can just add a little bit of uh, a little bit of ultramarine to it now and it'll just give you that little bit of a darkness can you see into it there just a little bit uh, just to bring it just like that, see, encroaching onto the path like that, and coming down this way. Now that'll suit you just for now, and just can just leave it at that. Okay, now get some uh, uh, some dark green now, which will you can mix with some uh, ultramarine and. Uh, bit of a cad yellow but it has to be a dark green so uh, maybe some umber a bit of uh, winds of blue is strong enough to give you the touch of green in it and just bring it in here bring your tree in here uh, just the edges of it uh, giving an idea of the tree. You can have solids inside the central part of it. Like that. Now I'm going to put a little bit of clearness in here. Maybe a little bit of like burnt sienna. Now if you want to watch more of these sort of things you're going to have to... I know you do all <laughs> You think it's a lot of money to pay for patron and man. I'm being mercenary, but even the camera, <laughs> unless you don't get much, I'm being honest, you don't get much off YouTube now at all. In fact, sometimes it goes over to you, you have to wait to the second month and add up what that you get first month because you don't make enough. Uh, I think myself, it's probably advertisers are not, not making, not interested in like the word because you get paid from advertisements you know being honest it's the advertisement you don't get it people just skim through you don't get paid much anyway they don't watch adverts yeah, sometimes you don't, don't get paid at all one month yet it, it has, as you look yourself you'll see what you can, what you earn on, on this. If people have the idea you're making a fortune. I don't know where they get that from. Maybe some young dolly birds too. 
but I'm not pretty enough myself so I can't do it. Oh where are we up to now that we are? We've got a little bit of uh, our umber just to bring in a bit of dark coming in here. Just uh, a bit more dark than that, a bit more dark. Just to give us a contrast here. Well, uh, We'll just bring in um, now the the, 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 the the I know this is dark at the front. I think it's some um, probably a bit tar, tarred or something like that. Like it's an old one tarred, the old tar on it, you know. But uh, if I make it black, it doesn't look nice. So we're using a bit of artistic license, and we're not painting it black. We're doing it in just a brown colour. There we are. You can. Like the roof, which is like uh, done with that. Uh, that's another what they call it. It's like a tarmac on it. It's a greeny castle. This hasn't it now. You can buy it. It's a grey. Just have a, a bit of white at the front. A little bit of uh, yellow ochre will do something like that. Clean the brush out first of all. That would be better, wouldn't it? Hmm? Yeah, okay. So there we have that one there now, coming down to there. Bit of light on the on the front there, catching the light. And the, now uh, the grey cast on the roof, but if I put a, a bit of artistic license we can't we'll have to make it on a a greener cast I think because uh, it won't look nicely on this one, so let's see if we can get something like a, and it, it will keep it in, it will keep it uh, in tonal values with the other rest of the, the painting, you know. And there we are, now I'll just put a bit of shadow under there of some kind before we put more onto it. And we'll bring a bit of shadow across the this area on the nondescript clouds we have. There we are. If you want you can put a few boats in here. Now the next thing we can do, I'll just uh, put a few little lines in. Now, uh, the this here, this has um, the notice on here about times and costs and all that. Charges are going across. Uh, there's our, our legs. And then we have this, the little platform coming out where they can sit. comes out here, there, say, that's the sitting area, and then, oh, of course, you have the, the steps down to here, like that, and you can see it's coming together. Little bit of dark under there, and there. Ah.
uh, there was your nice little painting for you. It wasn't taking long at all. So a little bit of a green across, across the front there, nice green with a little bit of, you know, you can put a cab cobalt there. Now I want just a little bit of, no, not too strong the shadow here. But that's a little bit strong, no. But that's about the light one, more or less. And then again it needs to be also it's a, we need to yellow that off a bit. It's a little bit on the green side and it won't match, it won't tone with it. I don't know but it seems like even the shadows and everything take on the surrounding colour. Don't ask me why. You know, we can have an out of out of sight tree there, bringing in some dark. Uh, a little bit of dark just here and here. A little bit of uh, warmth here. Now you could put two two little bolts here, which is quite quite easy really. You, you don't need a lot showing. So let, I'll just do it. First, I'll keep it straight. Um, a little bit of a tie point here. Right. A bit, bit, bit big this board, this uh, no matter the brush I'm meaning. Now that uh, that one. There. Just a touch at bottom. There. there. And then just a touch of a little bit of a shadow that way. Uh, a bit of patience you need, I've not got it at present. We'll call that no. a little bit more around here, a few bits here. So you are everyone, a nice easy piece for you to try. And oh yeah, okay. And as I say, there's plenty of other painters that can, you can look at on YouTube. I don't profess to be a, one of the elite artists, I'm not. You just watch what you like. Anyway, thanks very much for looking in. It's been very good of you. And I hope you appreciate it a bit too, because if you don't, go to some other artists and watch them. But for my friends and the ones who continue to watch me, thanks very much. For the others, well, what can you say? <laughs>